gone by holding up my pants. I turn up on the stage while I hit my dance. I get serious when it come to business. Don't waste my time, boy, you know that I ain't playing. I got a click it, click it. We move to come. 20 holes land where I'm standing. I never got you with the left hand. I draw down with the clock and the right hand. I got practice with me when I walk down. A lot of shooters waiting in a sprinter fan. I swear that I'm happy. All right, coming up next, it's a heavyweight collision between Kane Velasquez and the Reed, Alistair Overeem. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. The American is 35, the Brit is 37. He weighed in at 265 pounds. He will have a three inch reach advantage. Now for the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Here. Really good job blocking all those shots coming at his head. That one hurt. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Oh! It's very wobbly. He's trying to hang on. Whoa! Back to the feet. Alistair Overeem with a nasty leg kick. Hits home. Yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. Big knee to the body. How about that shin? Doing a fantastic job Whoa. of blocking shots. Big shot to the head. He's stunned. He's in trouble. He's rocked. Now a knee. Inside control once again. He's got his arm to the neck. He's looking for the guillotine. Nicely done. Velazquez gets back up again. Two minutes have expired in our opening round. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Snapped off the jab nicely there. Another takedown attempt here. Yeah, look at that takedown, oh, man. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground, staying busy. Looking for the neck. He drops down for it into the guard. He's free from the guillotine. He's got half guard. Just over two minutes to go in the round. He's gonna try to take the back, I think. And he gets reversed. Gets the back. Back to over under control. Staying busy in the clinch to avoid a separation. Oh, Looked like it did stun him a little bit. Defense there. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Knee to the body. Here's a single attempt. Oh, that's some wrestling right there. Trying to take the back here. Over 
gets caught with that punch, he'd be wise to get those hands up. Oh, he's hurt. That's it. That's it. The fight is over. Ken Velasquez extremely active with his strikes, and it led to his stoppage victory. Yeah, Joe, a lot of credit to go around here. You've got to credit the winner of the fight for his aggressiveness down the stretch. But as you did, you've also got to credit the referee here. He deemed that the defensive fighter was not intelligently defending himself, and he was in a perilous situation. So what do you do? You step in and prevent any further damage. Nice job there by the referee. We can see it here on a different angle. There are some big shots getting through here. Vicious ground and pound combination that leads to the TKO. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the win by TKO. That is one they'll be talking about for quite some time. All right, here's Bruce Buffer now Ladies with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee decision. Eve Levine has called a stop for this contest at three minutes, 58 seconds of the very first round. We claim the winner by TKO, Kane Velasquez! All right, congratulations to Kane Velasquez showing you yet again that when he is on and he is healthy, he might just be the greatest heavyweight in UFC history. Back injury certainly didn't seem to be a factor here tonight. Cain Velasquez turns back the clock in a big way, perhaps setting himself up for another crack at the heavyweight belt he wants on.